Time now for sports with Scott Breen. Welcome back, everybody. Your Class B football All-Stars opened workouts lightly yesterday here in Billings with two-a-day practices. Today, they're up to three. Same story tomorrow. Here they are, game planning up at Rocky Mountain College. Most of them say they've stayed in shape, though. Uh, not necessarily football shape, but remember, these guys all graduated within the last three weeks. This last summer before college is all play and no work, right? Nope, most of these all-stars say they're taking a quick break this week from summer jobs. Off the field, I own a lawn mowing business up in Fairfield. Really? <laughs> yeah, we're called Mowers of America, so... Yo, anyone needs their lawn mowed in Billings while I'm here, just, just let me know. <laughs> Actually, I work for my uh, linebacker coach, Coach Goodnight, on his ranch. Take me through a day. So he usually starts out about 7, if we both make it there on time, which is kind of lucky, I guess. But move water, kind of something different every day, whether we got to rebuild something in the corral or move cows and go to lunch. My dad does construction. I just work for him. Just take me through your day. Oh, it depends on where we're at. One time we're building a pole barn or pouring concrete, but most recently we've been uh, building fence at my grandpa's ranch. Uh, lifeguarding. Really? Yep. Where? Uh, at the Baker Rec Center. Okay, so take me through your day. Well, right now the pool's broken, our pump's out. So are you out of work at the moment? No, I'm a glorified janitor. <laughs> <laughs> uh, usually just a little bit of cleaning, and then we're sitting up in the chair, rotating every now and then, staring at people. There you have it, paid to people watch. If you want to watch these people get after it in the Class B All-Star football game, kickoff is Saturday, 1 o'clock at Herb Clint Field. Tomorrow we'll feature a pair of Townsend teammates, the only teammates in this year's game who will play college ball for the same school at Montana Western. It's a good story coming your way tomorrow.